What the fuck? Welcome to Nerd Guy Productions. How many times will I change the channel name? Let's find out together. Today we're going to be playing Control. Alright, and welcome back to another episode of Control. I am so excited to get back to this game. I was trying to record yesterday and I had maybe like one of the top 10 worst nights of my life. <laughs> Just everything I was trying to do to record, to do anything last night. Like, it was, everything was just going wrong. So, things are going better today. So, let's enjoy a little bit of control. All right, we're in a new area. The research sector. I do not know what's gonna be down here for us oh okay that looks pretty nice actually those title cards are so ominous let's see what he has to say Somebody thought this video would make for great internal communications I'm looking at you mr. Tomasi so well, is he looking at us from somewhere else? Where's Tomasi? Now that I think about it, it's been a minute since we saw him. I've always been here. And then through those years, we've made astonishing discoveries, authored studies of grave importance, and in all this work, there is one thing we know, and that's how little we truly know. Rest assured, we're committed to keep Wonderful. pushing the known laws and borders of reality, and to make the Bureau proud. So. Welcome. Assuming you have the necessary clearance and and to follow the safety protocols. Probably won't. Manual. I don't have a manual. Otherwise, bad things will happen. Well, I guess bad things are going to happen. Bye bye. Research sector, huh? Home of the bureau's mad scientists. Oh no, I'm not listening to that babble. Did I just hear something? I think we're okay. We're okay for now. Yep, we're doing okay. What's in here? Aha. Uh -huh. Something. Plant complaint. Hey, so I was just wondering about the plants in research. Is it really necessary to sing to them? Oh, don't tell me I have to deal with plants. Some kind of plant enemy. That doesn't sound like any fun. I mean, that janitor does have a nice voice, and the plants sure seem to like it. Maybe he could just switch it up a bit. I'm getting pretty tired of the tango. Must be talking about uh, Ati. And where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember when they were planted, and people like them a bit too much, if you ask me. Are we being invaded by houseplants? Hmm. Yeah, I don't like that. Uh... Keep an eye out for plants for me. Thank you very much. Shout out if anything. Ooh. I see you, you bitch. I see you. Oh, shit. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Don't you worry. Everything is fine. See? Easy. That actually was, like, rather easy. Sorry, I'm focusing. Oh, I just die already. What the hell? They have snipers now? Did it? it looks like a sniper. I really don't want to get shot. Trying my best, okay. Come on. I need some health. I'll be taking that, thank you very much. Now die, please. Hold on, excuse me. Please wait. Alright. 
only a few more left. You just die. He didn't even flinch at that. You just been hiding back here, you little asshole. Kinda of difficult to see right here. Woo! No! <laughs> Sorry. Woo! That'll get your heart pumping. Okay, this appears to be like a little itty bitty mini boss. Come on. You ain't shit. Get out of my face. Is that everybody? Is that it? Thank you very much. I'm glad you can all appreciate and realize who the true alpha in this situation is. Thank you, thank you. Alright, what am I looking for? There's a lot of the hiss blocking the way here. But the last time I saw a barrier like that, it disappeared fairly quickly, so we'll probably be coming back here. And you didn't escape me. Where are the speakers? I'm just, I hate the babble so much. Ooh, what is that noise? Do you hear that? Is that just the hiss? I can't tell if it's coming from that or something else. I'm seeing a lot more greenery down here. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> they told us to be wary of the plants. Uh, what's over here? Breaking your neck, dude. Aha. Threshold utility. Thresholds have always been sources of great inspiration and great challenge. When a new threshold manifests in the outside, in the oldest house, God, I'm sorry, by some, we never know what new discoveries it will provide to the Bureau, but we must always seize these opportunities. This report will examine the process of distinguishing recent threshold effects based on their utilitarian possibilities. The quarry brought black rock, that is hard to say one of our most invaluable discoveries but if the mold has any scientific value it has been difficult to find due to the lengths we must go to in fighting back the particularly the particularly prolific plant did they do this on purpose <laughs> like this is hard to read these are very distinct cases and worth comparing as their study offers vastly different dangers and rewards hmm okay this must be the mold they're talking about. Is this the same that hurt me before? Oh, it doesn't seem to be doing any damage. Oh, I see you up there. Can I knock it down? No. How do I get up there? I have no idea how I'm supposed to get up there. Oh, oh. maybe like, no, that's not gonna work. I don't know, whatever. Is there something down there? Oh, it looks like I do need to go down there. Uh, let's explore the area just a little bit more first. Mm, not seeing anything. You appear very dead. Oh, what the fuck? You hear that again, right? It's gotta be the hiss, because that's right above us upstairs, right? Collect, please. Thank you. Hmm. Oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry, that startled me. And if we go up here, we're just right back here. Okay. Alright. Before I go down the weird looking hole over there. Oh, wait a minute. What's over here? Sorry, there's a lot of different directions you can go, you know? Cafeteria. Oh, more music. 
Keep it going. Black rock analysis. Does it strike you as odd that Darling insists on having us appear in those bizarre videos of his? I mean, we just stand there. He doesn't even let us have lines or anything. Don't get me wrong, beats a day in the lab. Plus, it's always great to work with you. Oh yeah, I finished the comparative analysis of the two black rock samples you sent. The prism, or whatever you called it. I filled them in the usual place under C for Carla. A handy mnemonic device, right? <laughs> I don't get it. Anyway, let me know if there's anything you want to discuss about the data. I'll gladly explain. Maybe we could chat about it over some drinks or dinner even. Ooh, you're gonna get denied, dude. I can't remember the last time I had a good steak. Maybe we could go together after work sometime. I'm free tomorrow. How much you want to bet he was rejected? I'm betting a hundred dollars right now. All right. I just, I like it. All right, I'm sorry. Mm, something over here. The ladies restroom. This is a really nice restroom. It's a weird thing to like comment on, but it's a nice restroom. <laughs> Should I be opening the stalls? Is Am I gonna find anything? Am I just wasting my time? I feel like I'm wasting my time. Why is the music getting ominous? I don't like the plants. I really don't trust the plants. Alright, this appears to just be another bathroom. Men's bathroom. Also a really nice bathroom. There's something right here. Oh. It's just... Oh, what? Hold on. Okay, back to it. Sorry, just making sure everything's working. Okay, so I'm seeing a whole lot of nothing down here. There's one more area upstairs that I didn't explore before I got attacked by fucking everybody. And then I will go down um, the weird looking hole over there. I just... Mm. I didn't expect that. Fuck, that actually, like, really scared me. <laughs> oh, he's moving fast. What are you doing? Stop! Did they realize that I would go down there and end up coming back? Fuck. Who else? Who wants it? That's what I fucking thought. Okay, going up. Well, I'm going to explore this room, then I'm going up. Sorry, this place is huge. Like, there's so many areas to... That is so creepy. That freaked me the fuck out. Hi. How's everybody doing? You scared me to death. Can you move, actually? Hey, bro, you're in the way. You're in the way. I hope there's not, like, an achievement you can get at the end for not killing any of those people. I mean, they're practically already dead. You can't remove it from them. Synchronicity is a phenomena long recognized by the wise, but only recently given a name by science. It is how we rationalize events connected by no identifiable causality, yet clearly conjoined in purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? Why do hounds bail at the death of their master, which has occurred miles away? The world is unified in ways we do not yet understand, and sometimes we stumble across these invisible unseen chords and wonder at the result. The visionary Carl Jung laid the road, now we must walk it. My fledgling research department will make it our mission to reliably produce mm -hmm, behavior by the close of 1959. Well, we're well beyond that point. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science, History may not remember our names, but God himself will. Sure. Refire, refer, <laughs> refire to file <laughs> for full report. Awesome. 
Again, moments like this. Give me a flashlight. I can't see. Let me out! Make my own doors. Okay, going up. Let's see what's up here. I feel like now there's going to be more enemies. They're just going to start popping up. No, don't surprise me. Stop. Oh, Dr. Darling's office. Okay, I think we definitely needed to go up here. And I'm, I'm, I don't, tr I don't trust this. So, Dr. Darling, if you do anything funny, you're gonna have a nasty surprise to deal with. Hello. All right. Questions recently regarding HRAs. What are they for? Do you always need to wear them? That's cool, you can genuinely see the projection, like, on her. What's the deal with the Hedron resonance anyway? I... Fuck. Little drunk, sir. Are you a little Despite bit drunk? You may have heard. HRAs are not monitoring devices. We're not tracking your movements. Listening to your conversations. I'm trying to save your lives. We do that regardless whether or not is that a, you're wearing. Is that the hiss? Like HR. in the video? Think of them as a. Uh, as a uh, life preserver. Only instead of water, the, the thing HRAs protect you from is. Um, classified. One day that. Classified, not water, might pour in, and you'll be glad you got a got an HRA keeping you afloat. So, how long have they known that the hiss HRA, was coming? Don't worry, it'll be uh, quick and painless. Is that so? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah. We're making more. You're kidding because it's not quick and painless. It's probably a horrible, agonizing, slow death where you're aware of what you're doing, but you can't do anything about it. Something sort of, sort of like that, you know? Resonance theory, it's there, but we can't see it. It vibrates around us, through us, from us. I'm sorry, there's a lot of reading in this episode. It's just, it has to be done. But what if the vibration is conscious? What could a force like that do? Mm hmm open the door to a mm hmm I've called mm hmm the mm hmm emits a force that is far beyond the forces we previously dealt with. It has shown me so much that I have to wonder. Is resonance the key element in all altered phenomenon? AWEs, altered items, objects of power, do they share a common mm hmm that we've yet to discover? We can harmonize control points. What else would the correct frequency allow us to achieve? What if resonance has been the answer this whole time? Don't really follow. But maybe it is the answer the whole time, excuse me. Oh. No, I want I want to keep it going. I like the rhythm. Okay, some interesting little structures. Whoa. What are you trying to do? Astral plane. The Bureau has spent years studying, thank you. The Bureau has spent years studying why objects of power transport users into the astral plane when touched. My predecessor, Dr. Ash, theorized that a potential receptacle determined by Jungian archetypes and the collective subconscious, don't know what that is, would be inhabited by paranatural energies when an AWE occurred in its vicinity, creating an altered item. Over time, a link is was created by the mm -hmm, and the astral plane to that item, making it an object of power. So many additional theories have been raised since Dr. Ash's time. Objects of power were placed on Earth as tasked by some... Da -da 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 -da. Dimension was once part of the astral plane, and the objects were left behind as its borders receded. The astral plane was an early threshold into the oldest house, but the connection was severed, and now the two are linked solely through the objects of power. Hmm... I will attempt to disprove some of these in order to thin the herd. Hopefully the truth will emerge. Alright. There's so much to read in here, oh my gosh. Budget request. I suspect my colleague Dr. Harrington has already contacted you asking for an increase in her department's budget. I'm not surprised. 
Parapsychology has always been the squeaky wheel, all fuss, but no results. That's rude. Parakinesiology, I'm sorry, I'm not very good at this, has always been the stronger department. More breakthroughs, more tangible data, more usable research. Yeah, fuck you. Uh, I'm sure a man of your esteem can plainly see which department is more deserving of the budget increase. Just think what those additional resources could do for an already formidable research team. Anyway, blah blah blah, Abraham Lewis, you fucking suck and I like you already. wonder if we get to meet him. Why do I take like a whole bundle of books? <laughs> Alright, so there's nothing in here besides lots and lots of stuff to read. I feel like I kind of wasted my time up here, damn it. Dr. Darling is insistent that certain objects of power share a direct connection to the mm -hmm, an entity or group of entities that we have little information on. Oh, what? Or little that I'm allowed to, ac to access. In his written reports, he states that there is a clear link between these objects of power, the mm -hmm, the astral plane, and the oldest house itself. So there are like other beings that we... Could that be P Polaris, the um, person inside her head? His work supposes there's these links are innate, a fact ingrained into the very mm -hmm, of objects, such as the hotline or the service weapon. A hotline will result in grievous harm or even death if the user is not the director, or at least worthy of the role. Why do we assume this involvement by the mm -hmm, is a natural fact, not something more? Uh, that interests me. Alright, is that it? It's just gonna swing forever, damn. Come on, man. What the fuck? What is that? Oh my god, that scared me really bad. That looks really freaky. What the fuck? It's like Professor X. <laughs> but with the powers of the Phoenix or some shit. I don't know. I didn't like that. That was not cool. Dimensional research. Should I even go? I think there's more enemies. Hold on. Please. I don't want to go back down. I want to go into the dimensional research, and you won't let me. You keep throwing more enemies at me. Please stop. Please stop. Where's your friends? I don't want to go to them. They got to come to me. What is that little hole right there? Whoa! Fuck you. Dirty son of a bitch! <laughs> There's so much! There's so many. There's so much. There's so many of them. Oh, what the fuck? I don't want more Professor X's! No! 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 <laughs> I don't like them! Ooh, I'm really close to death, too. That's not good. I gotta get towards that health. What the fuck? They just disappear? What? I'm so confused. What just happened? They just disappeared. Okay. Oh my god. No! You die first. Professor X, I don't like you. How about that? Energy limits, you shitheads. Okay. What the fuck? I'm over this shit, dude. Did I like restart the encounter by accident? I think I did. Yeah, I think I accidentally like restarted the encounter. 
Oh shit! Oh. Stop, stop. Are they like torture victims? They, they're like bound to chairs. This shit is fucking weird. I don't like it. No. 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 That's so ugly. What's going on? What is that noise? This game has got me on edge right now. Holy shit. Okay, killed them all. Got to meet a new enemy. Don't like Professor X. He's a douchebag. Um, he's super creepy. Alright, I have a stanchion and it's coming with me. What the fuck? Okay, I think this is the right way to go. I'm not letting this thing go. The impossibly changing labyrinth. What? Dimensional research. Every measure of security. Okay. It's getting darker. Oh no, this looks fucking weird, dude. Okay, I can't get in there. The patterns on the wall are legitimately fucking with my eyes. Oh my gosh. Okay. What should I be expecting here? What's that noise? Oh my god, that scared me so bad. <laughs> Holy shit, I just got chills up and down my body. Hold on, give me two seconds. I gotta pause this. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, and we're back. I'm sorry for having a little mild panic attack. That got me really good. It sounded like it was right behind me because I have my headphones on and everything. That freaked me the fuck out. It freaks me out, okay? The noises it makes, the things it does. I don't like this. I really don't like the noise. Is it intentionally like... That... Oh shit. Why is that so huge? What in the fuck? Okay, so there's gotta be a way to figure out how to get through this. And there's gotta be like a pattern. I think I'm making progress. Maybe I'm not. This is so fucking weird. Damn it. Guess you just gotta keep doing it. Am I not moving fast enough? Is that the problem? No, I don't think that's the problem. Just keeps leading me out, what the hell? Okie doke. Thanks to that little thing I just found. Basically told me that I can't beat this part or, it actually was, uh, saying, without spoiling anything, which means that something about that area is important, obviously we'll have to return, um, if you're just wandering around in circles, confused, just leave the area, because you're not meant to be here yet, and I was like, okay, definitely just wandering around in circles, very, very confused, so I'm not meant to be here yet. So, can you calm down? 
So clearly I did need to go down that hole at the very bottom, which is kind of frustrating. Basically just wasted everybody's time considerably. I'm sorry about that. But uh, let's head on down. See what we find. Oh, I didn't notice this. Hold on, let's take a look. Emergency call summary. A possible AWE in in which an unnamed individual experienced transcorporeality via a phone line. Event is notably similar to AWE. Uh. Event is believed to have been caused by hmm, and as a result, the following measures have been taken to prevent hmm, 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 hmm. So this is clearly a very <laughs> secret thing. I can barely read anything on that. What is that area up there? How do I get to that? Hmm. Can't get through there yet. So yeah, it's definitely got to be that hole at the very bottom. I don't see anywhere else to go. And I have exhausted literally every other option, so... <laughs> there we go. It's the best way down. Drop down here. Down here. Uh, I really don't want to die. gonna work. Okay. I think this is working. What is that noise? This is getting creepy. I don't like when you have to go down, you know? Going down into the, the pits of hell. Who knows what this is gonna be. That all looks bad down there. This is gonna suck. I can feel it. Oh god. Ew, did you just see that? They're releasing their spores at a little butthole looking thing. Uh, oh my god, my tryptophobia is like kicking in in here. Nope. I gotta go. I gotta go. I'm so freaked out. I'm fucking freaking out. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look, it's me. Like, how is my picture already overgrown with all this mold if this clearly has been going on for a while? What the fuck is this place? Where does that go? Sh should I just check it out? Oh. Surprise, surprise. I'm not scared. I don't get scared at games. Are you kidding me? I get terrified. I feel like I'm supposed to go through that door, so let's just explore a teeny bit more. Oh. Power core, what would we need that for? Come on, I could really use some music right now. Okay, let's just keep going. That fucking sound, dude. Just like a breathing. It is so dark in here. Okay, clearance level four. That's definitely off limits for me for a little bit. I don't think I should get on top of that, but let's try it. Okay, we're good. It's be neat to have us your office, right? My mound of mold. I cannot see anything, dude. That door's locked up tight. I guess I'm going that way. Don't worry. If you're not creeped out, good. You shouldn't be, because this is absolutely not creepy at all. This is... 
that. back out of here. The music's going like there's an enemy and I'm super nervous. <gasps> oh! They're re- they're like way stronger. Holy shit! Alright, I'm gonna need those rocks. I killed it. Right, now that I'm about to die. Oh, did I just waste all those? I'll use these on you guys. these assholes they just got way way harder like out of fucking nowhere <sighs> I just feel like I had to have taken a wrong turn there's no way the enemies would jump up to that difficult out of nowhere and why do I have to fight them all over again like these enemies Honestly, maybe a little easy. Can't be challenging. Ah, oh, fuck you. My fucking god, are you kidding me? I have been going the wrong direction. <laughs> Even when I changed directions and went somewhere else, that was still the wrong fucking place. There, I feel like that proves that this game is huge. There's a lot of different ways you could go. But if I could get just a little bit more of a hint as to maybe where I should be going, that would be great next time because I'm almost positive this is the way to go. Oh my god. What the fuck? She's in trouble. Oh, I hear. I hear someone. I need to reach her. What is that? Oh, it's a dead body. Okay. I mean, who cares about that? Um. All right. So I can't get through there. What's over here? What's that? What the fuck is that? Okay, so I gotta go through parakinesiology and astral exhibition. Oh, whoa, this looks hella trippy. Alright. 
Alright, I'm digging this. This is super cool. I'm sorry it took me so long <laughs> to get us to this point, but I refuse to just cut out all the other nonsense. It's the damn doorways behind me that scare me so bad. completely filled with the hiss. Oh my god, there's a person in there! Okay, so that's why we have the Professor X's. There are people being tortured or something? No, he's completely surrounded by the video screens. I'm sorry, man, I can't help you. And they were recording it, and what the hell? They knew this hiss was coming. More people... Uh... Oh, he was standing up, and he is now sitting down. Shit is weird, dude. What does this say? Emergency call supplement. Transfer of a call to the California State Emergency Services. Dispatcher, 911, what's your emergency? Hello, hello, I'm here, can you hear me? I can hear you, ma'am, where are you? I'm um, inside the wires, I'm lost. Have you been drinking tonight? I feel like I'm stretching through the wire towards you. Don't hang up, I might go if you hang up. Go where, ma'am? Go, gone, away. Okay, and can you describe your surroundings? Unknown noise. Ma'am, hello, ma'am. Dispatcher attempted to call the number back, but it was no longer in service. Ooh, that's trippy. That's pretty cool. That would make a neat little short horror story. Whatever the fuck's going on with you, man. Nope, don't like that. I'm assuming I gotta go through the astral exhibition, but I would like to check out what's up here real quick. Nothing over here. More stuff. Down. Playing dodgeball? What's going on there? I think that scared me. <laughs> Alright. Well, the hiss seems to be coming through on all those TV monitors in there. And through the lights. And obviously the speakers and everything. Is it technological? Is is that somehow related to it? I don't know. Uh, do I get to clean this area? Yes! See, that's how I should have known I wasn't going down the right path. I wasn't coming across any control points to claim at all. Regardless, this place is vitally important to the Bureau. Yeah, yeah. Most information on the astral plane is, is classified, but we can talk in broad strokes, keeping in mind that these are staggeringly complex systems. And simplification does them no justice. Now, the white non-space, the ever-present inverted black pyramid, the board, all linked, intrinsically tied to the oldest house, tied to the director, the process of choosing a director, tied to all objects of power in terms of who controls them. Can? Yes. <laughs> That. Is that the Bureau? Is that technically like how big and ever expansive the Bureau is? Or at least what they've like, recorded thus far or something? That's my guess. 
astral exhibition, or maybe the astral plane. That's all the bits of the astral plane they've explored. It was originally built for the astronauts. <laughs> Sounds really hokey, but I mean, I guess it works. Place to grow accustomed to the sights and sounds of the astral plane before diving into the real thing. We could have done a better job with it, but mm -hmm, was being stingy with the budget. Who's mm hmm? Can't be any character that I know of right now. However, once we discovered the mm hmm, we decided to repurpose the space. Similar to how zoos hope familiar surroundings will help affect the well being of their animals, we hope to observe the mm hmm's behavior in an environment similar to its home dimension. So far, it just breaks everything we put in with it, but Rome wasn't built in a day. New naming conventions have been established for the astral entity, now known as Astral Spike. Outdated terms in this report have been redacted. Astral Spike? So is that a new enemy that I'm actually supposed to come across? What is this? Can I activate it? Useless! What's this? Oh, another little video. Sorry, lots of reading, lots of videos, lots of going absolutely nowhere in this episode. I apologize. But that was fast proven wrong. It's an actual place. Not a construct of the mind, even though it is with our minds that we enter and experience it. But then, one could argue that that's the case with all reality. True. Very true. We've been able to record footage of the astral plane by monitoring the brain activity of those experiencing it. Hmm. That is the only concrete material that has come out of the astral plane expeditions. Uh, apart from one shocking exception. Which is? In the astral I'm not going to explain footage, that. We're always in the vicinity of the pyramid. We've concluded that this, not the entire plane, is what the board controls. We have glimpsed movement native species always in the distance and yet contact was made games getting more and more interesting we don't have footage of this a technical malfunction but when one of our astronauts returned a brain cloud an astral fugue had hitchhiked a ride in his head what? it ruptured out killing the subject oh, in question shit. it's a relentless predator pursuing thoughts minds lethal to those the entity feeds on Proper containment protocols are to be observed. Fantastic. I'm so excited to meet this new type of enemy that tries to steal thoughts. I've always been what, bitch? What'd you say to me? Can't break these ones. She was talking shit. You heard that, right? What the fuck? We might as well continue. I can't believe they keep that thing. Right? Why would... Do I have to go through there? Shit, dude. Seems like it's moving fast. Whoa. Maybe cheated a little bit once again, but I'm supposed to lure it in here. And then push. Ah, fuck. I fucked it up. I think I'm supposed to press that panel. Uh, 
think, yeah, it's supposed to be that panel. Shit, it's kind of fast. you do it? Oh. I need to power it up first. That's part of the problem. Is it coming towards me? What is it doing? This way, buddy. Come on. What the hell's it doing? Come on. Come on. Just gotta press the button. No! Slowly killing me too, so can't keep doing this. Maybe it's because there's two fucking batteries. Get shit. Sorry, I'm so stupid. It's gonna fucking kill me though. <laughs> I can't phase through it like I did before. I'm gonna have to wait, go around, and then hope I have enough time to make it. Come on, come on, a little closer, a little closer. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes! What was the Bureau doing with that thing? I don't know, but it just chunked away at my health really hard. Fuck you, you little shithead. Right, heading to parapsychology. Someone answer, damn it! We need backup down here. Marshall, oh, Marshall, Lawrence, are right. you still there? Shit! Come on, I was, We're so I was right close. here. We need to hurry. Okay, we'll keep going. Oh no! What is that? He, his clusters heal other enemies. Destroy them to make the fight easier. No problem. Oh, and they move. Great. Now you don't have your friend to heal you up. Sucks to suck, right? Oh! I need the health. I just needed that health. Goodbye. Oh shit. Ah, fuck you, Professor X. Always have to make this shit so much harder than it needs to be. I really don't like those guys either. Can you not? If I have to do that fucking astral spike bullshit again. Oh, I don't have to actually do it again. It'll, it'll just let me go right to the next spot. Okie doke. You know, I think I'm going to go ahead and do that, actually. Let's try and beat that fight. It didn't seem like it was exceedingly difficult or anything. I was just low on health, didn't prioritize the fight well enough, and I forgot I got to kill. Fuck. Cluster dies first. Let's 
just deal with the chairs first. I see a lot of them. Oh, actually, I think I just killed them all. if you want me to like move out of this area to a different spot but no I won't that still damaged me too alright you just gotta like sidestep him the last second so many dude this that's fucking bullshit that was so many I need health, I need health, I need health. That frame rate, that is just dropping. <laughs> what did you miss? Focus. Killing the frame rate. <laughs> Trying to enjoy the game. the music so they're not all dead. Whoa. Where? Where is this last person? I feel pretty good about that. Hmm, the hiss seems to be really collected right here. You can hear like whispers and stuff. That's really creepy. Let's cleanse this area. Dang, we made a mess. Cleansing it on Whew. I feel like I can breathe again. That must be the way forward. We've encountered heavy resistance. We've fallen back to the lock department. All agents are ordered to converge here. Sit over here. Hello? Ooh, a little cutscene. Marshall, can you hear me? Yes. I, I wanted to explore that area this? a little bit more, but... My name is Jesse Faden. I'm coming to help. Faden? 
Hold on. I'm sending the elevator for you. We need a talk. You got that right. Yeah, we do. More of you? Really? Oh, what the fuck? Elevator. Elevator. Anytime. Elevator. I will go down that elevator in just a moment. I knew there was stuff to read. <laughs> oh, what? A new mission? What? Captive audience. I don't know if I want to activate it. What is it? Investigate the X-ray X -ray light box, object of power. Okay. No, I don't want to set that as my main mission, though. Actually, yeah, I might. <laughs> Just taking a look around. Group think. Study extent to the work of blah, 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 blah. the passive or active use of telepathy to prove these connections. The parapsychology department carried out variations of solemn. Blah, 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 was then used to identify a telepathic interface within the group. Further empirical findings suggest measures can be taken to safeguard against telepathic influence on behaviors by engaging. Why that boldly? This maybe that's what the X-ray machine is. I'm gonna keep the X-ray mission as my main one for right now, just so I remember to go back and do that when I start up again. But I'm gonna go down this elevator first and see where it takes us, and then I promise I'll call it quits for a moment and we will start up again on another episode I think that's the first time oh what the fuck this building is so weird welcome to the party now Marshall is right down the hall I almost shot you I didn't know if I could trust you all right Marshall's right down the hall. Let's meet up with Marshall, and then that'll be the end point. Or should I leave that as the cliffhanger? Hmm. If you want to see who Marshall is, wait till the next episode. Wait a minute. This is where we were earlier, right? Fuck yeah, it is. So this is how you get to this area. Interesting. Yeah, I know. I know where she is. Alright, just because I jerked y'all around so much going the wrong direction again and again and again, we will go ahead and take a look at what Marshall looks like. Talk to her. Are you guys okay? What the fuck is this? Can you please... Thank you. I was like, render the object. You guys seem pretty run down. There huh? you are. I was starting to worry. Who are you? I mean, I know you're Marshall, but like, who are you? What's your deal? Congratulations on your appointment, Director Fagan. Thank you. I'm Helen Marshall, head of Bureau Operations. Zachariah's dead then, and I assume you found his gun. Right here. Just call me Jesse. Trench told me to find you. He said you could help. And he told you this through the hotline? Yeah. Makes sense. None of this phases her? Yeah, she's just like, mm -hmm, of course, yeah. Really? Here's the situation. Darling created the HRAs in a lab nearby. We need more if we're gonna survive this attack. My rangers can't secure the lab alone. Not against those things. We need more firepower. At least she seems to know what's going on here. Yeah. She could know about Dylan. Maybe... I can clear yeah, up this. I'll be your firepower. Let's be her firepower to get the answers. Is she testing me? It seems me? like it. 
Darling has systems in place to protect his labs. This should help you get past them. We'll talk more after you clear out the hiss. Okay. Rangers, let her through. We'll have to lock the door behind you. Sorry, but we can't risk a breach. <sighs> Collins, watch the situation. Squad C hasn't made it back. They're still out there, which means we should assume they're here. Alright, and that's going to be the pause point. <laughs> I don't really feel like doing another fight right now. So, we will return to this game very shortly. I'll probably end up recording another one tomorrow, so it won't be long before the next episode is up. Still really, really digging the game. Um, I can tell there's, you know, there's these little mysteries just building under the surface. We're so close to a few, I can feel it. We would be much closer if I didn't go the wrong direction twice. <laughs>